today video it's going to be all about google photos in case you're not aware google photos is probably one of the best software that google has ever made and if you are young enough in brackets to remember picasso that's actually how it has begun but anyway guys so this here is google photos some recent controversies around this was google dropping the almost like free forever hosting of the images of course with lower quality now you need to pay if you want to move some storage and in case you also didn't know when you press here the edit right there are some enhancements here that have the google one logo so let me just show you guys if i want to enhance the picture i can do this for free and by the way you can see how it works it's really amazing but if i want to use the dynamic preset i need to unlock this feature and more with the google one membership okay this makes sense i mean of course we know what google are doing they push the pixels they make one of the best if not the best camera for smartphone photography they reinvented smartphone photography they kept the same sensing almost all of the pixels after the tree and etc right and of course google photos what is important for today's video is that they added silently two new features one is to sharpen images right and the other is to reduce noise and they did this for free so there is a new denoise tool and a new sharpen tool and this is what i want to test in this video and show how you can access it so very easy guys so if i press edit here and i go scroll to the right to adjust i can control the brightness you see okay it's for free but if i want to control the hdr yeah i need to unlock it but what is important for the video guys if i keep scrolling i'm gonna see these two new things and you see there are now with these yellow bobs. So if you see the yellow bob, it is a new thing, okay? Yellow bob, new feature. So sharpen is the first one. And the second one that we have is the denoise. And this is actually what I wanted to test with you. Now they go from one to zero, and this gives actually the users some control over really how much you can apply the feature. If you like it, if you don't like it, it's up to you. Also what is worth mentioning that a lot of the new smartphones are anyway applying a lot of denoise and sharpening when you shoot pictures like this. So this is pretty much what smartphone cameras are about. They're very clever they use a lot of ai they have nice isps and they use other software things computational power to apply these great effects to make your picture look sharp to make your picture look very vivid and very bright now the thing is guys if you still are not happy with a the picture then you can still go into the google photos and use sharpen and denoise functions for free let's start with the sharpen now zero okay then you can apparently go and see it becomes more and more sharp you can go up to 100 okay i probably can show this to the camera all right so this is here zero Okay, and this is here 100, okay? To try to illustrate it in the best way, I'm gonna zoom the picture a bit so you can see the magic behind, okay? So this here is right now at 100%. I'm gonna zoom the boy riding the bike, and you can see it's a bit blurry. And I'm gonna start now slowly adjusting here the slider. You can just see, when I go to 100, we have really a crisp picture, okay? This one I can save, all right? And I can go to denoise, so when I go from zero here to 100, and I'm trying to zoom in a bit, you're gonna see, yeah, the results are a bit mixed feelings. <laughs> this is really how I feel about this. We're here at zero denoise. I'm gonna go slowly and gonna go to 100, and you're gonna see that the overall effect is causing a bit more blurriness. And this is not bad, right? If you use this in low light scenarios, then maybe you're gonna get some nice results. So the denoise will give you a bit more artificial blurriness. If you don't like this and that's not your thing, then don't do it or just do it on low light. In general, those are these two new features. That's why I said short Sunday video guys. If you like the video guys, consider subscribing to my channel. Please stay safe and we're gonna catch up in one of my next videos. With that said, VST over and by. Again, sharpening and denoise from Google Photos for free.